This is the Ummah of Tawheed. There is one country that shall go unnamed where a donkey is being worshipped in the grave. There is a donkey buried there and people circumambulate. They make tawaf around the grave of this donkey. What was so great about this donkey, you might ask? It was a special donkey, actually. This donkey had no shadow. He used to belong to a, a righteous man. And then donkey, so the man was so righteous that his donkey became righteous. And his donkey has no shadow. Okay? Maybe they looked at it at night, I'm not sure. But it's buried there. It's a, histor it's a well known fact, it's not a secret. People come, they make tawaf. So, can the Ummah be victorious when donkeys are being worshipped instead of Allah Azza wa Jal? Or if thousands upon thousands of graves, there are certain countries, again, it will go unnamed, where you have to ask at that masjid, does it have a grave inside or not? No? Okay, let's go pray there. So many masjid have graves inside them. So many people, their hearts are attached to things besides Allah Azza wa Jal. To little amulets, to little things that are folded and little things that have to be rubbed and, and kissed and rubbed again, all kinds of strange things. The other day someone was asking me about peer. I never knew about the peer. They said there are these, these people called peers and they have to approve of you and everything. I said if they have to approve of you, that's a lot of pressure. I would call that peer pressure. <laughs>